guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode one of Hori Mia. So let's go ahead and get started in three, two, one, go. Oh god, fuck, that's loud. Girl's name holding. Do you have something better to do? Hmm? Maybe she's got a date. Probably. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. Okay, she got a cleaning date. Okay. Isn't that wait on a time out? <laughs> what the fuck?
Oh. Uh oh. Hmm? Uh -uh. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, No, you can't flat out ask him. Uh. Oh, he's so cute, I can't. <laughs> oh, and smile. Mia, you're more Neku than you realize. Like, <laughs> he's just a cool guy. His eyes are really pretty. You got it. You can make it.
Why do I feel like somebody's gonna see him though? Oh! Outside of school. Ah, uh, you pay everything. Plenty, of course. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
complicated. You gonna show me cocktails? Excuse me. Mm, I don't know. <laughs> no, but you are. She's gonna tell him no. Uh. <laughs> oh. 
No. And besides, this isn't a boy's love story. <laughs> okay. I don't know. I, I like this a lot. I have a lot of questions about it, though. Okay, so from what I saw in the trailer and such, I already knew this was going to be like a romantic comedy rom-com series. But I'm also expecting it to get a little sad. I mean, there were like sad moments in the trailer, but I mean, this is only episode one, so we can't really figure it out now. But yeah, it's nice. Like, Cody and Mia, they're just so freaking cute together. This is going to be another couple that I'm going to be shipping for the next 13 weeks. Technically 12. But hey, it's okay. Because <laughs> this is words because you have my baby. My emo boyfriend, Neku. <laughs> Playing Mia, like, oh my god, out of all the people, it had to be him. <laughs> he just going to be ready for the world's end with you, and I'm not ready for it, damn it. Uh, but it, this is good. They're cute together, and even though it's only the first episode and they're not really together, technically they're kind of together, but they're just cute. They just have cute moments. They're dating even though they're not really. They're just good friends. But it's going to be hella complicated. <laughs> hmm? Oh my god, are you okay? Did you not sleep? Oh, are you going to cry? Uh oh. Poor baby. No. <laughs> <laughs> but something tells me that of course um both of their secrets are going to be found out that you know Mia has a whole bunch of tattoos and piercings and that Hori you know is a completely different person when she is not around her friends. Of course one by one it feels like everyone's gonna find out but I feel like there's going to be an episode maybe like episode six or episode seven where the whole friend group Hori's friend group mainly finds out about Mia and it's like that or maybe the whole school I don't know because yes when you look at Mia you don't think this is the same guy who has tattoos and piercings literally looking like Neku Sakuraba but except you know difference because he has blue hair and Neku has pretty large hair but yeah I, I mean it's really good and they're super adorable together I mean so they're hanging out and you know hanging out with, <laughs> with her little brother it's just so adorable because she get I'm not she well really yeah what do you know yeah what do you yeah Hori gets to see Mia in a different light and same thing and vice versa and it's cute I mean I like the fact that they get to only show certain sides of each other when they're at school when they're alone together with um Hori's younger brother I think it's interesting but yeah something else is gonna happen whether it is her friends dude who just tried to confess to her in this first episode and then you know got let down because it happens something else is gonna come up don't know what don't know when but we ain't gonna know until then. I think what I want to do with this series is I kind of want to read the manga for this. I think I'm gonna wait until the show is over because I don't want to know anything. 
<laughs> and all the challenges they're gonna have to face so yeah i think i'm gonna wait until the show is completely done and then try to read the manga but yeah other than that guys that is my reaction review towards episode one of horimiya if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel i make videos every single day join the master squad and of course i will see you guys officially all next saturday for episode two bye guys